This video focuses on general safety practices for operating farm loaders and skid steer loaders. Tractor rollovers are the primary cause of farm accidental deaths, and many of the rollovers occur when operating tractors with loader attachments. Rollovers can occur when the bucket strikes an obstruction, such as a truck box or embankment. Operating loaders with the bucket up also increases the risk of rollovers. The most important way to prevent serious accidents with loaders and skid steer loaders is to equip them with rollover protection devices, or ROPS, and make sure you don't exceed the maximum load limits as described in operator's manuals. Be sure the tire spacing and rear ballast is correct before using a loader. Always wear a seat belt when operating a tractor and loader or skid steer loader. Loaders overturn easier if the bucket is raised too high when loaded, especially when turning or on uneven surfaces. Understand that the center of gravity with the load changes with the load in different positions. The center of gravity of a load lifted high increases the likelihood of a rollover. A top-heavy condition can lead to a backward or side overturn. The likelihood of rollovers or tipping increases if you raise and lower loads too fast and or change the lifting rate. Always stop loaders gradually when raising or lowering loads. Be particularly careful when lifting loads around people. Loads falling on people are common causes of accidents with loaders. If you must move loads around people, be sure to fasten the loads with ropes, chains, or cables. Turning uphill on a slope increases the risk of overturns because the center of gravity moves to the rear of the implement. Turning too fast on a downward slope may also cause an overturn because the center of gravity is transferred forward. While driving a tractor and loader on public roads, carry the loads close to the ground to aid visibility and to keep the center of gravity closer to the ground. Allow for the additional equipment length while turning. Be careful to balance loads so the weight is evenly distributed and the load is stable. Avoid carrying loads wider than the tractor. Use flashing warning lights and slow-moving vehicle emblems on loader tractors whenever operating on public roads, and never operate a tractor with a loader on public roads after dark. Do not handle large round bales unless the loader is equipped with an approved bale handling attachment. Using a regular front-end loader to move bales poses a problem because the bale can roll out of the bucket and down the loader arms onto the operator. Do not lift round bales with the standard loader unless you have proper bale restraining devices. Tractor rollover protective structures are not intended to protect against falling bales. Remember to keep the bale as low as possible while moving. Always engage the parking brake or place the transmission in park. Lower the loader to the ground, shut off the engine, and remove the ignition key before servicing loaders. Know and avoid the pinch points and rotating parts before doing maintenance on loaders. Do not walk or perform any service under a raised loader, bucket, or attachment unless it is securely blocked or held in position. Escaping hydraulic fluid can penetrate skin, causing serious injury. Avoid the hazard of high-pressure fluids by relieving pressure before disconnecting hydraulic lines. Tighten all connections before applying pressure. Search for leaks with a piece of cardboard. Following safety precautions does take a little more time, but being safe is your number one commodity.